Now we're going to go ahead and add the potentiometer. Uh, I'm using now we're using the three-quarter inch screws this time, uh, and I've counted seven over and two up for the initial screw. Uh, notice our wires are pointing towards the uh, the Cortex controller. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, put the nuts on here and just spin those right up. Uh, I'm snugging them finger tight, and then of course we're going to. Uh, tighten them down. Honestly, at this point, I would have just chosen. Um, uh, I thought the power tool was going to be necessary. Uh, at this point, I'm I'm going to say it's absolutely unnecessary because the way that these are coming together so nicely, um, it is going to save me a minute here and there, though. So, okay. So now we have the that's the potentiometer is on now. And next we are going to go ahead and add the uh, 36 tooth gear. So here we have the 36 tooth gear, right? We have the drive shaft and we also have the collar. Um, and the collar, of course, is going to fit on, uh, it's going to fit just like this. Okay, so we're going to fit in the two inch drive shaft into the potentiometer. Then we're going to put on the 36 inch, or sorry, the 36 tooth gear. Okay, just like that. And then we're gonna go ahead and slip the collar on just over over that. Okay, and we're, uh, and then we'll go ahead and tighten that down. Okay, uh, this is a different drill bit. Um, obviously, I forgot to get the correct drill bit, so uh, uh, that I'll tighten it up uh, off video.